Uh, many thanks for coming. There is strong recognition all over the world that fiscal austerity pursued by many governments has been the main cause for the protracted economic downturn. And there is a re-examination of such policies and a much, much more serious reconsideration of the need for fiscal stimulus and other efforts to ensure a strong, sustained and inclusive recovery. The uh, election results in France, uh, the election results in, in Greece, and also uh, the election results in a number of states in Germany have fundamentally changed the political atmosphere. And it is for this reason that I am uh, a bit more optimistic. The, there, there is very little grounds for optimism if you look at the data. But I, I think the political atmosphere has changed. And we are in a situation now uh, where the tide may have turned. And we may well see a serious reconsideration of the kinds of policies which the United Nations has been advocating consistently over the last few years in, in favor of a strong, uh, sustained and inclusive recovery. If the uh, situation in Greece would, would worsen or there would be uh, uh, very severe speculation about it exiting from the Eurozone, that would uh, quickly spill over into uh, uh, the banking system in the rest of Europe, uh, and through that could uh, spill over into uh, banking sectors uh, in the countries that also have very high sovereign debt risk, like Spain and Italy, and through that uh, uh, in an escalating uh, crisis.